Aoniche, Aodanse. Welcome to another episode of Kuma Bakolo, the essence of talk, a show where we analyze the words and expressions behind instances of spoken or written Monday. Aiwa, Ankata. So these, uh, today's episode, sorry, today's episode is going to focus on a headline which actually is a tweet. So this headline or this uh, instance of writing comes from Erefi Mandenka, who you can follow on Twitter, and Okodi Oko Ulumata Sar Die with Marse Yala Cheoka Kanka Muso Bolobo Bao Bie Uka Donye O Korokodi. So what does that mean? Let's jump into it. So first, let's take a step back and look at the tweet. We can actually see here that there is a picture of someone being interviewed, and that person is Ulimata Sar. So we can see that she's named in the instance of this. All right, so let's take over our headline and keep Ulimata in mind. And let's jump over to, if I can get over there. Ah, Yang. I'm going to play Sisan, Sisan. Aiwa. So Ulimata Sar, Bie with Marcie, Yala Cheoka Kanka Muso Bolobo Bao, Bie Uka Donye. Aha. So let's read this step by step. So Ulimata Sar, Bie with Marcie. So Ulimata Sar, B, today, uh, B, today, Ye Wit Marcie. So this is written in the French, right? Wit Mars, meaning the 8th of March. And we have Ye, Ye, meaning today is the 8th of March. This is our equative, right? All right. And so this is actually as if they're addressing her, saying, Hey, Ulimata Sar, B, Ye Wit Marcie. Today is the 8th of March. All right, so let's break that off as its own clause. All right, so they've said that to her. O temeninko okodi. So after that, what do they say? Uko yala cheoka kanka muso bolobo bau. So bau means because. So let's consider that another clause. All right, so we got bau meaning because. Yala cheoka kanka muso bolobo. All right, so what does that one mean? Yala is actually going to be a question marker. Uh, so if we look this one up, that's going to be in the dictionary. You can see it over here. Muso ye yala. So the interrogative particle, uh, meaning a question marker, and it goes at the beginning of a sentence. And you can see it's marked here in the dictionary as being something like esque, like in French. All right. So if we go back over to our document. Uh, Yala, so this is telling us it's a question. Cheu, o koroko di nambafuko che. So che koroko men. Che koroko men. Cheu men. Yala, so do, as in a question. Cheu kakan ka muso borobo. All right, so actually our verb here is going to be, uh, or one of the verbs here is kabulubo. And this should be one word. It's been written as two, that's a mistake, but it's because the word comes from. A combination of bolo and bo. Uh, bolo meaning arm and bo meaning to come out of or to exit or to take out of. So it has something to do with the arm and this notion of uh, exiting or removing. So let's see if we can figure out what that means. So yala cheoka kanka muso, right? So muso being women, uh, so uh, muso, a woman. Uh, and muso women and kakanka. So yala cheo kakan ka. This ka here is going to be goes with bolobo. That's the infinitive marker. So ka moro bolobo would be an expression that actually means to, right? So ka is like to in English. Ka moro to to somebody to a person bolobo and what does this actually mean as an expression well if we look it up in the dictionary i actually did it before for you guys and okodi oko kabo bolobo meaning dispenser or in french permettre de se reposer so this concept permettre de se reposer means to enable someone to be able to rest so uh if we keep that in mind so let's say uh, to enable uh, someone to rest. So, yala kakang. So, something about men and needing to help women rest. And kakang, right? That actually, this verb here is a qualitative verb, which normally means equal, to be equal. So, we can say, ne ani ele 
kaka. You and me are equal. Uh, but actually, there's an expression that goes along with this. Kaka, ka, and then another verb, which is going to mean to need to or to be required to do uh, another verb, right? So, yala teoka ka. Ka, so do men need to, right? That's kind of how we can translate it idiomatically. Do they need to do what? Bolobo, who? Muso. So do men need to enable women to be able to rest? And now they're going to tell us explicitly why, right? So they, oko bao, so this is normally spelled bao, biye uka donye, biye uka donye, huh? Don don do. Whose day is it? Muso ka don. So don actually here. Let me throw in. Uh, don means day, right? Uh, bao means because. Uh, B we've already seen, right? So that one is going to mean today is. What is today? Biye uka don ye. So that we have ye ye of our equative, and then we have uka don, meaning their day. So today is equal to their day. And then actually note here, we have a question marker here, which is really interesting because we also had a question marker up here, but went up front. So yala typically goes at the beginning of a question where wa, which is much more frequent, appears at the end of a sentence, right? So we have wa meaning question marker. Uh, so let's put it all together. Ulimata sar biye wit marcie. So Hey, Ulimata Sar, today is the 8th of March. Let me ask you a question. Yala cheuka kanka muso bolobo. So, do men need to enable women to rest? And then our last part, bao, because biye uka don yewa. Because it is their, it, because today is their day. And there's a question mark at the end. Aiwa. Don't, don't ye Ulimata Sar ye. Who is Ulimata Sar? Ah, uh, Muso Bilibili Badode. She's a very important woman. So let's have a look. She actually, uh, Aflenie, Nie Ulimataye, Abebo Senegal. Abebo Senegal, Abe Barake, Onufe. So she works for the UN. Uh, Ani Abe Barake, Walisaka Seka, Musoka, Joyoro Sabati, Giancono. So she works to promote the role and uh, strength of women in the world today. Uh, so she was on RFI Mandenka ka haklina di amma to give her opinion uh, on RFI Mandenka to all of us. Aiwa biye muso ka donye. So today is the eighth of March, which is International Women's Day. So I thought this would be a great headline for all of us. Nala sona video ni diara auye. If you liked it, feel free to give me a thumbs up or write me a comment and let me know. Aiwa kambe aunite.